talks about analytical study design so we are coming back to our flow chart did investigator assign exposure so here answer is no that means analytical study designs are observational in nature do this study has comparison group yes so these are the observational studies with comparison group these are known as analytical study now what is the direction exposure to outcome so it is cohort outcome to exposure it is case control or at the same time it is analytical cross-sectional that we will see code study could be in future that is prospective or it could be done in uh, past that is retrospective or it is having data from both sides that is MB spectral. So let us look at one MCQ to determine the associated factors of anti-hypertensive drug compliance. An investigator selected 384 participants with hypertension who were undergoing treatment in tertiary care hospital. The investigator collected details on socioeconomic background and took history regarding consumption of medicine in past two weeks. Then the drug compliant group and non compliant group were compared to identify factors associated with drug compliance, which type of study design it. So, first of all, see whether investigator assigned the exposure of taking the drug or patient were already taking the drug. So, investigator does not assign the exposure. So, it is an uh, observational study. Now, do this has comparison group? Yes. Uh, group which is drug compliant and another group which, which is non-compliant so it is an analytical study so it is an analytical study which is used to identify the factors associated with the outcome or drug compliance so what is the type of study design so it is basically a cross-sectional study because it is happening at one point in time so it is analytical cross-sectional so here investigator does not assign exposure observational comparison group are present analytical and we have to identify the factor associated with outcome at the same time that is analytical cross-section exposure is not assigned by investigator in following study design that is all all are analytical study design cohort case control and even cross-sectional has an analytical variant so all of the above Exposure is assigned by investigator in which study? It is experimental study. The example of which is either randomized or non-randomized control trial. Now these two terms we should understand very clearly. Dependent and independent variable. The dependent variable is a variable that is affected or expected to be affected by independent variable. In such a study, the it is also known as outcome so dependent variable is usually outcome and independent variable is the factor which affect the dependent variable or outcome so independent variable is known as exposure okay so whenever you hear these two words dependent variable that means outcome and independent variable means exposure and exposure will may or may not lead to outcome so two things are very clear from analytical study that investigator does not assign the exposure there is no randomization and here we'll take careful measurement of pattern of exposure and disease in population there is always a comparison group presents which help us to make inferences about exposure and diseases. Uh, in next sessions, we will talk about individual study designs which are analytical in nature.